probably the most serious concern we have in hearing God's voice is this. What if I get it wrong? What if it was just a figment of my overactive imagination or something I made up? During medieval times, church leaders were deeply concerned about preserving biblical truth. If the common people, with a lack of education and their sinful nature, if they read the Bible for themselves, they could make mistakes. This was sacred scripture containing profound theological truth. What if they got it wrong? So they chained the Bibles to the pulpits and banned their translation from Latin to the common language. Only authorised priests could read the scriptures and interpret them. After all, the people could misunderstand them if they read them for themselves. Could we get it wrong if we try to hear God's voice? Yes, absolutely. But at what cost if we don't try? Fear of error amongst those church leaders meant that multitudes of people could never get to know God for themselves through the pages of the Bible. So can we know then if what we're hearing is from God? It's such an important question, but it's not a new one. The ancients faced exactly the same problem. And the good news is that God anticipated we would face it. In response, He has provided us with a number of safeguards to follow so that we can know if a word is from God and therefore minimise our mistakes. We just need to learn them and put them into practice.